Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Hi. Um. Well. Hello. There we go. Um. Looking at me like that. Uh, first off, you can see we've got quite a bit of green down there. Uh, trigger cane's grown, not that that matters. Um. First off, let's come down here. I don't know how much, how many levels this thing can hold. What's in here? Hmm. Getting all this stuff now that I don't need it. I might actually look into a, uh, I'm actually going to stop at level 47, because I think, um... The Enchanter stops at level 25? Mm. Uh, put that in there, that in there, that in there. Uh, give me a second. Take this out. 28. Oh, right! Goes up to 30, doesn't it? Okay. Oops. Right. I don't know if there's enough in here to give you a little 30. Yeah, not quite. Alright. Um, so I know a few things that I'd like to do. First thing I'd like to do is I just kind of want to work on a few of the smaller achievements in the book that I've skipped, which is make a... uh huh. Excuse me. Just make a mattock, which I believe is some sort of farm tool. I'm not entirely sure. I'll look it up. Um. And then upgrade an existing tinker tools with a metal part. So the bone axe I made, I'll probably uh, upgrade it with like uh, an iron axe head or something like that. Just to go ahead and get the achievement done. Just barely. I am like point something XP away from leveling up. Um, something else I wanted to work on is an auto compressor. Uh, basically, I'll be just be able to put a this auto compressor over here attached to this. Uh, probably with. Oh, I'll need more than just the auto compressor. Um, I, if I get an auto compressor and filter through just the bags, and then power it with one of these extra flux points that I have. I guess it's not extra, it's just one of these flux points. I don't know if I'll take it off of these or just make a new one. I'll probably make a new one. But if I power it with one of the flux points, it'll take all of the bags, and it'll take all the loot bags out of this. Auto-compress them into the next level loot bag. Thank you. And uh, then I can just open... A really high level loop. I think gold is the highest level loop bag, and I think that's technically like level five. So let's see, we got that and that. What do we have? C efficiency four. C fortune efficiency. Let's go with this one. Fortune two efficiency four. All right. We have now enchanted a sea of mesh. Still doesn't look like I get much. Oh well. Oh, we're going to put the laps away. Uh, put that away. Put that in there. Put that over here. Do one last check of the farm. 
grab the last of the inferior that may have grown or go into the farmer and then i will look into the mattock and upgrading the axe the bone axe okay Hmm. Okay. First thing, let's look at the bone hatchet. How do I change? Um. Pretty sure it was this one. So I just I, I kind of want to just make an iron axe head and or not the axe head. Well, it is the axe head, and then see uh, how to attach this iron axe head to what I already have existing. So that I could try to find out how to uh, actually upgrade the tools. And then the mattock, depending on what it is and how to use it, depends on what I make it out of. Okay, so I do need the two iron ingots for that. Okay. Ah, is it just one feet? Doesn't look like it. I guess it doesn't matter where I put it. But iron hatchet. There. Upgraded. Probably won't use it much, but it's upgraded. Uh, I'm going to quickly grab the achievement book. Sleep for the night. Okay. Go ahead and do that. Do that. Make a Maddox from Tinker's Construct. Maybe there's something I missed. But if I look up Maddox, it's not here. Is there a, a book for Tinker's Construct? I don't remember. Integrated Dynamics? Nope.
All right, hang on. Let me. Okay, a mattock is made with a shovel head and a hatchet head in the tool rod and a tool rod. Okay. So hang on. Since it's probably not something I'm going to use a whole lot, I'm just gonna grab some bones. Boy, they are dying quick. All right, so I need a shovel head, a hatchet head, and a tool rod. Oh, it's right here. Okay. I'm gonna just make the bone medic. Not gonna worry about uh, uh, upgrading it at all because I don't plan on really using it. But uh, ain't very many. Oh, 
lot of things that I really don't care about right now. Um, I don't have a whole lot of time left. I'm going to look into the auto compressor. Compressor, four crafting tables, four iron ingots, and a block of iron. That's I'm going to need to make one of these. God, I forgot how much this needs. Tell you what, for now? <laughs> um... Take one of these. Okay. The problem is now I need a way to actually put all of these into this automatically. What I might do, I'll probably get some more cobblestone, uh, spread this out a little bit, because I need uh, item transfer pipes, conduit nodes. So that I can uh, transfer items out of the storage casing or storage box, and and into the auto compressor. But I'll need to make filters so that it's, it's the item transfer nodes move only the um, the bags. Otherwise, it's just going to grab everything. And if it can't go into the... Uh, if it can't go into the autocompressor, it's just going to clog up the pipes. So if I just break that... that. Oh. It's in here. I'll just honestly if I just move it here yeah. Take it easy. Okay. Okay, so I need one single item transfer pipe. Okay. Hmm. 
Oops, that's not really. All right. Transfer node. Items. Okay. There's supposed to be a receiver node, I believe it is. Retrieval node for fluids. Retrieval node. Okay, not, it's retrieval node, not receiver node. But yeah, retrieval node. And then the filter. Basic item filter. Uh, is that the one I'm looking for? Counting existing item like what's the fucking difference? Selects only items already in the inventory, right click while sneaking on an inventory to add the content to snapshot. Okay, I think I just need the basic item filter. Pretty sure that's all it is. Jesus. I should have had more emeralds already. What happened to my emeralds? I didn't use... Oh, there they are. Okay. I just feel better to have it all in one place right now. Alright, I don't want it to be too long. So next time, I'll uh, make the item... The transfer everything to go from over here to uh, over here. But I just want it to move bags from here to here so that these... This, these, this can compress the bags. So it'll take all the blue bags and turn them into green bags. I, I will have to come back just to move items from this side back to this side so that it can take these green bags, make them into blue bags, the blue bags into, I think, gold bags. So I guess the gold bags are level four, not level five. Either way. Uh, um, next time I'll get that finished and uh, set up for it to work. I think I only need one... Um, of the item filters. I should only need one item filter to take the bags out of the storage crate. Because I shouldn't need a second item filter for those bags to then go into the auto compressor. Because if they're the only things being taken out of the storage crate, I don't need a filter what's going into the item compressor. 
Unless there was some fork in the pipe somewhere. But I I should only need one of the basic kind of filters. So I'll get that set up and done next time. You, uh, you're, you're preoccupied with standing on your head, I guess. Um, I guess he's got nothing left to say.